announcing the giant selection. You want to be watching this live. Hoping for Will Hernandez or Harold Landry. Come on, Justin. Don't disappoint me. I would be happy with James Daniels as well. Hell yeah, Justin. Let him know. In Dallas. In Arlington. Yeah. Let him know. Will Hernandez, baby. UTEP. Love it. Awesome, big, mauling, run-blocking guard out of University of Texas, El Paso. Basically, he's Richie Incognito, V2. He is gigantic. He's like 350 pounds, runs very fast, very quick and agile, extremely athletic. This can help out the offensive line so much. You bring in Nate Solder in the offseason. Now you draft Will Hernandez. At center, you do have a bit of a hole. I think... Um, is Brent Jones going to start there, or is it Barrett Jones? Why do I, why do I say Brent? Um, I think Barrett Jones is going to start at center for the Giants. Is he still even on the team? Not Barrett Jones. I'm, I'm screwing up my... I, I can't remember who the center is. I feel like I'm extremely uneducated right now with my own favorite team. I can't remember the name of the Giants center. He didn't start last year. Uh, you bring in Patrick Omame in the offseason... And then maybe Eric Flowers can even slide over to right tackle, where hopefully he's not an abomination. Will Hernandez is absolutely the best player on the board. He's becoming a New York football giant. That left side of the offensive line with Will Hernandez is borderline elite with Nate Solder. And now what should have absolutely been a first-round pick in Will Hernandez. Super excited that the New York Giants uh, went with him. Very, very excited here. That offensive line is becoming better and better and better. You got to check out center. I think we're fine at tackle for this draft. If Eric Flowers is going to slide over to the right side. This could be a very good offensive line. But that's going to do it for me, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I am so excited about this pick. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take it easy.